Hey everyone! Today I'm coming to you from live and direct from my kitchen. So, I've um, been working on a few bits and pieces. This is my... Let's put that back up there. This is my wall hanging. I've made the hanger and wrapped some bead trim around it. I've put some organza ribbon just dangling from the center. Then I've got some organza ribbon as in for holding it. Um, I've pleated the organza ribbon up here to form this um, braid. There's just lace underneath. And then here I've um, done some embroidery with ribbon on her flowers here and on a hat. Then I've trimmed it with this um, trim here that I got gifted to me from Rachel. So thank you very much, Rachel. Um, and a handmade flower with a miniature doily. And then this is just cur neck curtain. And um, some of the tri some trim, the same trim that I trimmed the hanger with. Um, and this image I got from Pinterest, just to let you know. Then I've got some more of this trim here. Um, and then I've got uh, this trim, which was also gifted to me from Rachel, so thank you. And then underneath this trim, if I just lift that, I've got vintage trim just here. And then another layer of vintage, vintage trim. And then with this linen, I've just... Um, frayed it round the edges um, and that is my little wall hanging that I've made um, the linen I got masses and masses from it, of it ages and ages ago I went into a charity shop and um, I was looking at the fabrics and they said oh do you like fabrics and I went out the back and had thousands of meters well not thousands but a lot and I got quite a few bits and pieces so that's where all my sort of fabric comes from but I like this and um, I got it because I wanted to use it for embroidery so um, yeah so that's that and then also if I just move that out of the way there and then also I um, in the charity shop that I volunteer in there was a pair I have got another one in fact I should have brought it down to show you what it looked like without but these are just plaster and they've obviously been put into a mould and then um, they were just painted cream and they were just plain, there was nothing on them so I painted the um, cameo in black but you couldn't actually see the detail so I got some of the Inca Gold um, rub and buff like the gilt wax and then I've just rubbed that over a facer which sort of brings out all of the features just there then I've got a little flat back pearl at the top there I've got some pearl trim around here and then I've got some more of this lovely um, lace that was gifted to me by Rachel and then um, another handmade flower and a little vintage button on the inside I think that was all it needed I didn't know whether to go over some of it with the gilt the um, gilding wax but I think it's just fine as is so that's a couple of things I've been working on so um, I hope you enjoy and uh, I shall be doing some more videos over the next week have fun keep crafting